environmental disaster photo that resonates globally. Seeing the image, you know something is happening. It's a story that has many layers. It's not deals of oil, it's not deals of migration, it's not deals of what's left. This is like really a respectful collaboration. In South America, we had a wide range of entries from important stories to important emotions last year. I didn't really understand how important it is to have really a group of people from the region taking decisions until I, I took part of it. I learned even from things that I didn't know about my own region. So I think we have a good representation for the region and very powerful work. The single was pulled out from a story that was talking about the oil spill in Peru and its effects on the environment. I think it's an um, environmental disaster photo that resonates globally. It's a beautiful image of a horrible situation and an important problem that unfortunately happens more often than it should. In stories, we awarded the Alpaqueros in Peru. It's a story that provides a fresh angle to a very important story. It's a story that when you first look at it, it is really beautiful, but it, it tells a lot about the climate change. It is a nice way to grab your attention in a refreshing way. It is really well executed, really well edited. This set it has a two layers about the loss and the preservation then the first one and uh, last one, it's totally matched to the, uh, this storytelling. It really shows the culture and the laws, but also how they're trying to fight that and, and find solutions for that in that region. The long-term project, we awarded an entry from Venezuela. We all felt it was very important to represent Venezuela since not only is a country that has been suffering from a political and economic crisis for many years, we also saw uh, how the crisis there affects many other countries in the region. And it's some very nuanced photos that feel like together make this amazing understanding of what's going on from the ideals of oil, to the ideals of migration, to the ideals of what's left as many people leave and many people still try to find home and hold on to their identity and hold on to their culture of a country that they that they love that they call home that project is a very subtle almost poetic uh, way to talk about the issues um, in in the country uh, in the open formats we awarded a story from Ecuador which talks about a very important issue uh, of how you grow up with your mother in prison. And it touches in, in uh, many important problems in a very beautiful and, and uh, subtle way. La cárcel significa como que algo que es como que a veces necesario, pero algunas veces no, porque tiene a gente que no debería de estar ahí. This is really a respectful collaboration. That's why this project is so strong, because like it's really like the equal collaboration and the equal amount of photos of the, this girl of, and of the photographer mixed together in, in this uh, video. And it's really nice how the photographer working uh, in this respectful way. The way that the author told that story through the eyes of of, of a child talking about her experience and her life and her dreams, we all felt that it was really a different way to look into this issue. <laughs>